Hello, I'm Clara and this is Lewis from TDI Tuning. Today we are talking all things tuning boxes. Because I've got some questions that I want answered. I'm sure you have some questions that you want answered and this is the man to do it. Lewis, how are you? I'm very well, thank you. Are you ready to talk tuning boxes? I think so. Okay, so let's kick it off with a nice simple one. What is a tuning box? So a tuning box is a small device that sits inside of your engine bay uh, that changes the sensor readings to actively enhance the performance of the car. Okay, so why would I need a tuning box? Um, you might need a tuning box because uh, manufacturers actually limit the amount of power each engine has. So for example, Ford have the one litre EcoBoost and they make it in three different power outputs for the Fiesta, which is 100 brake horsepower, 125 and 140. Um, so they mass produce an engine uh, and they tweak it slightly differently so they can charge more for the more higher powered one. Um, they also need to think about EU regulations, so emission standards and things like that. So they're not going to produce a brand new engine because they want to sell it in a different country. They're just going to slightly tweak that engine um, so they can sort of save on costs. Okay, so talking about the tuning boxes, are they easy to install? Yeah, they're really easy to install. They look something like this. This is a TDI oh. tuning box. Okay, um, feel free to have a look. Mm -hmm. Um, they're really easy to install. They simply connect to the engine sensors that are already present in the car uh, and then they route to that tuning box where it stores the specific map configuration uh, that will then alter the car's performance and then unlock the power. Okay, perfect. So this has got like some different settings on here. So is it slightly different for each car? So yeah, you know? so the tuning box itself is rewritten for different cars and you've also got seven different programs on there as well. Wow. So if you don't want to drive it to its full potential at number seven, you can knock it back down a little bit um, and then sort of drive it more economically as Hence well. That's the plus and minus. That's it, so you can choose what program suits your driving style best. So that's pretty simple. Um, I guess for a lot of people, their cars are quite precious, they love their cars, so if they're gonna get one of these and plug it into their car, they wanna know, is it safe? Yeah, so because they, um, they don't actually overwrite any settings that the manufacturers sort of set to begin with, uh, they just work in harmony with them. So it's perfectly safe, it's not sort of going over any safety settings that was already once there. Um, it's working, in, as I say, in harmony with them. Okay, brilliant. So it works in harmony with the car, with what's already there. It just kind of unlocks the car's true, true potential. So I brought one of these, I've installed it into my car, and then I decide, uh-oh, I want to sell my car. What happens with this? Um, so you can uninstall it. It's quite easy to install, and it's uh, even quicker to sort of uninstall it because you already know where everything is. Uh, take it off, send it back to us, and we'll reprogram it for your new car. So it leaves no trace whatsoever left behind, digital or physical. It's pretty impressive, isn't it? Such a little bit of kit. Well, hopefully that's some of your questions answered about tuning boxes. We'll be back with lots more videos, but for the moment, please make sure that you like, subscribe, and comment on the video. If you have any questions, whack them in the box below. Not a tuning box, the comment box below. <laughs> uh, and we'll do our very best to answer them. Thanks, and we'll see you soon.